Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to Arrow Gamer. It's me, Arna, back with another Roblox video. And today we are playing Roblox Jailbreak and the new Molten M12, the new Volcano Base, the new Town, and the new Prison Improvements are finally here. And I'll be showing you guys exactly what it is. Now, it is really early in the morning here. So my voice is a little bit different um, than normal when I record in the evening or the afternoon, but it's fine. So let's get into the video. So first thing is, the first thing is that there are arrows, not just here, but also out here that lead you right to there. And there are now footprints on the trails that you can walk on so right here there's footprints and then there there was footprints right back there and here's the exploding wall with gravel or not gravel but rocks <coughs> and you just stand on the x and hold e and the wall will explode and you just jump like that now this right here <coughs> used to be the visitor section I'm sorry that my voice is like that, guys. It's really early. Um, this right here was a visitor section, but now it's a garage. And let me show you exactly what I'm talking about. And right here, there's some footprints. And they're, like, glowing. So, yeah. And there is no more tree there, guys. And right here, there is Electric City or, like, those shocky things. And this area is mainly the same. And there's just some steps there. This area stayed the same. But then out here, there is now the garage. Right here is a police section and then the SWAT section. In the police section, there's a Deja, the Cirrus, and the patrol bike. And the SWAT is just a SWAT van. And you can go from SWAT side to the police side and back. And here is a door, and it will just lead you to here. And I wish that Simo added, like, an actual door here. So if you had, like, a key card or anything, you could just, like, scan it, and this would open up, and you could just go by. But, Simo, do not do that, and now you have to go all the way around, or just go from that door and back. Um, yeah, I put this exact same thing, technically. Right here, there's some more footsteps where you can just crouch. And there are now two Camaro spawn points. One Camaro spawn point right here. And another Camaro spawn point right there. The same spot. Now, I'm going to spawn my Deja. And you guys saw the new vehicle for a second. And we're going to go to the new town in three, two. Alright guys, before we go to the new town, I just want you guys to look at this old town after the volcano erupted. Let's go now. Boom. Here is the new town, guys. The new gun shop is right here. And we'll go inside of it really quickly. The trees are a lot bigger now, and I like the trees more. This is the new shooting range and the new gun shop. It looks a lot bigger. Here's everything, and then here's the shooting range, and you don't go into it like you did earlier. You just kind of, like, stand out here, and you can just grab your gun and just start shooting. And you can just grab the guns like normal for the same spots. Um, they're all in the same spot, so that's something that I like. And we're just going to get back into the day show. There's a new waterfall there, and... Up there, there are some houses. Um, okay, that's like a dead end, and I feel like they might expand to that very soon. But right here, there's this area. First off, they added a satellite here, and I do not know why. But, there's this area. And, I saw those houses. And I'm like... Why are those houses in the middle of nowhere? 
and you really can't even get to it, otherwise you'll lose your health. Um, actually, okay, yeah, you cannot get to it, otherwise you'll lose your health. Okay, get out of it, get out of it, get out of it. Okay, we're out. <laughs> um, but, yeah, you can't even get to those houses, so we'll, those look like the old town houses. So will they expand that area or what? Now, this is a garage. Now, if you were a true OG to jailbreak, um, you guys might notice that even in the 2017 um, garage, they had the Tesla on top. But the only difference is that there is no little things on the side. You just customize it normally and then you can just get out and there's two there. And then, yeah. This right here is the new 1M dealership. And the blade is here. The volt bike is here. And then that is, the monster truck is there. Now, in the video, we saw that the volt, that the blade had a wheel. It does not have a wheel. But the ladder is now on the inside. And you just climb it. And you come to the Blackhawk. So the ladder is now in the inside and not the outside. So this is the 1M dealer. There are just some random buildings here. You can't get inside of them. This is the glider shop. So it's a lot bigger and you can just click on the glider and you can just use it like normal. This right here is a new donut shop and it finally has those googly eyes on it. And then the drive through and the door is now right here and you still, do you knock it? Okay, you still get a donut when you get in. Um, it was a little delayed, but you still get a donut when you get in and you can still rob bad CC except I'm a cop so I can't. And this donut shop is a lot bigger than the old one. There's some seating here, and yeah. There's another garage right here, which is the technically the same thing from over there, except this one has three garages, one on this side and then two on the other side, and it has a Tesla. This is the new gas station. And then there's this building. And I don't know if you can get inside of this building. No, you cannot get inside of that building. Um, but I like that they added a fence here. Like, that's, that's nice. Um, let's get into the actual town now. This is a new town. The houses are all different. Um, and I like this town a lot more. And you guys might notice how you guys can see inside the houses. You can also go inside the houses. Like if you're playing hide and seek or something, you can go in, you can go in the rooms, and that is just so cool. That you can actually go inside of some of the houses. And maybe they'll add robberies in those houses. Like you can like rob the house. Like that would be really cool. Um, okay. You can go inside of this house as well, and each house is a little bit different. Some have two stories, some have one story. Um, but they're all houses. And I don't exactly know where the Deja spawns, the Deja Vu. Okay, Deja Vu spawns right here, guys. <clears throat> if you're wondering. Deja spawns right here, so once you go to the, if you go to the um, garage, you just have to go straight technically and it'll be right here and it's this house and you cannot go inside of that house so you can only go inside of some of the houses now right here is the new volcano and the smoke is still but right there is the platform for the new vehicle and i'll show you guys that in a sec but can you die from this you do die from that do you no wait you don't Okay, you don't die from that. You don't, okay, you don't die from this lava. It's just for show, I guess. But from the inside lava, you do. Now, I've already checked this map up before recording, but I was not able to check 
the new vehicle out because if I come in right here, first of all, the flooring is different in this. Um, I like this flooring a lot. There is no safety glass. And I fell in and I died. So, yeah. We'll get onto that in a little while. Uh, levels do not reset this update, I don't think. Um, because I just literally never got levels because I haven't played Jailbreak for so long. But I don't know if they reset. Um, but this new thing looks so cool. Um, I don't know what's in there. might be a little different. But we'll see. And right here is a brand new m12 molten car and okay it's only six hundred thousand dollars technically it's five hundred ninety nine thousand dollars and it's a one-seater and asimo said oh wait it's a two-seater okay wait it's a two-seater and asimo said that this is probably now the fastest vehicle in the game so we're gonna buy it and see it's a one-time purchase. It's only in the game for 10 days, starting from today. We're going to buy it in 3, 2, 1, boom. We just bought the new M12 Molten. Okay. That sounds really nice. Oh, yeah, I see the rocket fuel. Okay, comes out from those two. The lights are on the back. Um, oh wait, let me turn on my siren. Um. Okay, lights are on the back now. And then some are in the front. But let's turn that off and let's customize it first. Okay, whoa. That looks really good. Now, there's C there and it might be interior. Okay, it's not an interior view car. So you cannot see inside of it, but it's fast. By the way, the arrow color changed. Um, it's now white. It's fast. Whoa. It sounds really nice. Okay. Yep, this is really fast. Okay. Whoa, okay, whoa. It's actually not very hard to handle, but it's so fast. This might be faster than the torpedo. I don't know guys, we'll have to do a speed test on this in a future video, but this thing is really fast. Um, yeah, this is really fast and it sounds so nice. Okay. Okay, does it UFO? Um, we have to test out if it UFOs or not. But I would definitely recommend buying this vehicle. And if you don't have that much money, you should probably grind for it. Okay. I don't think it UFOs. It does not UFO. It just bounces off of the wall. Yes. The vehicle does not UFO. It's just my avatar is like leaning forward and just his head is gl glitching out. So it's a really low car. Um, but it's a really nice car, and I thought it would be this car from the beginning um, once that video came out. Another thing that I wanted to share is that the servers are larger now. So instead of 26 people in a server, there's now 32 people in a server. So I really, really um, like that. So there can be more people in a server at once anyways big shout out to skyline for making this vehicle um it's really good and thank you so much it's also really fast and i hope jailbreak updates more like this like this is probably now going to be like my main vehicle now like i literally love this vehicle now but um, you should probably add interior into this SEMO, um, like interior view, so you can just press C, and you can just look like this.
except a little bit different. <laughs> it's just a great update overall. And I like that you added an actual garage there because the visitor section, literally no one ever used that, like ever. So thank you SEMO and Skyline. So we do need to call it a video right here. Once again, thank you to Skyline and SEMO for making this update happen. And yeah, we do have to end the video. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys enjoyed this video, please subscribe to my channel, turn on post notifications. So you guys are updated whenever a new video is uploaded. And let's get this video up to 50 likes. So like the video. Alright guys, see you in the next video. Bye!